Minnesota Fine Vikings still have a decision to make this offseason with running back Dalvin Cook, who does turn 28 in August. Yes, he's had his fourth straight 1,000-yard season. Yes, he made his fourth straight Pro Bowl. But as the Vikings are try- starting to save cap and they're starting to get rid of some veteran players, could Dalvin be part of that youth movement and be shown the door or traded? It, it, it is a possibility. And, and Dalvin, in his contract, he's due a $10.4 million base salary. Basically what it comes down to, because $2 million of his uh, salary this year is going to be guaranteed, is if they cut him, they save $6 million on the cap. If they trade him, uh, they save $8 million. That's where the Vikings are currently at. And Dalvin, uh, he released a, a bit of a hype video, a cryptic video, a... Is this a goodbye video? Is this a let's get it video? Uh, is this all the above video? Uh, so the chef, number four, uh, you know, tweeted out uh, this video put together by his agency, LAA, loyalty above all. And, of course, it was highlights from this season. And he had a number of them where you know, Dalvin rocking the number four, which he wore at in high school and at Florida State, I loved, even though 33 looked good on him too. You know, catching that one in the end zone from in Washington from Kirk Cousins, that was fantastic. The long run at home in Miami. Mm. There have been some speculation that maybe the Dol- the hometown Dolphins would trade for him. They obviously have a need of running back, but then they resigned Raheem Mostert and Jeff Wilson today. My name is Jeff, uh, so that door is probably closed. And then, of course, the 81-yarder that got the party started against the Bills in that comeback, and then uh, just looking good overall, number four, as well as uh, the game-time touchdown uh, gets the uh, against the Colts on that screen pass. Hey, hey, uh, Vikings actually had a successful screen pass. That's one. Last year, kind of crazy, huh? Uh, and the Dalvin also, we need to talk about his gritty. It wasn't very good. I mean, l- let's be honest here. And of course, la what with all the branding. And there, there's a lot of ways to look at this. So number one, it could be a Vikings. We're coming back. Let's go. Uh, also, it could be number two if the Vikings are looking to move on or if they're still actively shopping him. Hey, screw you, Vikings. I still got it. Or if the Vikings do trade him or cut him, uh, looking at prospective teams that could trade or sign him, hey, I still got it. So I, I think it's a combination. I think it's hedging all the bets. Basically, I, I don't see it as like a career highlight goodbye video like we've seen from some other players. I see it more as a I still got it. That's right. Yeah, 2022, it was a relatively good season for Dalvin, even though he did have a career low of 4.4 yards per carry. But a lot of that could be chalked up to offensive line play, as well as a shift uh, away from the running game by Kevin O'Connell and the direction of this offense. So I don't really know. Yeah, but like I said, uh, Quasey, he's uh, pinching pennies and he's looking towards the future. And uh, Kevin O'Connell gushed at the combine talking about second year running back Ty Chandler. Uh, TBD, what happens with Madison in free agency uh, as of right now? Now he hasn't signed anywhere, so who knows what is going to be happening uh, with the star running back. But I, I think that he does – well, he would have had some trade value, but some of the places he would have gone are drying up, and it is a young man's game, the run, running back position. It is a position of attrition, and you got to get yours while you can. And will the Vikings pay you know eight figures for a running back? I don't know. I don't know. Is that really sync up with what Quasey wants to do analytics-wise? Or is it a spot where you've already lost so many veterans, just completely uh, washing the decks would not be a good move, and Dalvin clearly still has it, especially with an improved offensive line? We'll see. We'll see. Like, like I said, I- I'm ki- kind of good either way. Like his number, I mean, the, the work with it, uh, his salary and the-, and the cap. And if he gets traded, Vikings get a pick. Great. Uh, if not, and he's still around, uh, also that's fantastic too. But your thoughts are thoughts. Uh, Dalvin puts out a, a cryptic video highlights whatever goodbye hype video let's get it who knows uh let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below subscribe for daily vikings takes must support the work put a little something in the venmo but to next time skull production value